Hello and welcome everybody to uh, listing outcomes on my maths a walkthrough. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to work through this uh, listing outcomes uh, question that I've posted on my maths. Um, I didn't personally post my maths put it, but I assigned to the class. Um, so all you're going to do is first of all read the question carefully and then fill in the table to start with. So the question said. Uh, there was two spinners which were uh, spun, and then the two spinners, the results were added together. So the, I need to know that they were added together uh, to fill this table in. Um, and then I fill the table in and try to answer the two questions which were the follow-up. So if I look at the table, I've got spinner 1 maybe at the top, so I didn't write that down, and spinner 1 at the side. Uh, the weird number's on, so I've got to be careful. Um, if I just look what this already in, it said spinner 1 got a 1, and spinner 2 was a 3, so 1 and 3 was 4, 2 and 3 was 5, and so on, fairly self-explanatory, keeping in mind it was added. So I'll just fill this in now, so it's spinner 1 was a 2, spinner 2 was a 4, 2 and 4 is 6, uh, 1 and a 4 is 5, a 3 and a 4 is 7, uh, a 1 and a 4 is a 5, uh, so I can fill them in. And the next one is uh, 3 and 1 is 6, 2 and seven, three, 5 is 7, sorry, two, 1 and 3, I don't know what I said there. 1 and 5 is 6, 3 and 5 is 8. Uh, down here we've got 1 and 3, 2 and uh, 3 is 5, 1 and 3 again is 4, 3 and 3 is usually 6, 1 and 3 uh, normally 4. Okay, so fill them in. <coughs> Next thing is to work out the probability that I was going to get a 5. Uh, well, to start with, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30 results. So the probability is going to be out of 30. Uh, this probability is going to be out of 30 as well. So I'm just going to go that. Uh, right, so probably I get a 5. How many 5s is there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So it's 10 out of 30 uh, for the probability of getting a 5. Uh, the probability that it's bigger than 5, greater than 5. Uh, now the interesting thing is it's not equal to 5 as well. So you only count on 6, 7, 8. Often people will count the 5 as well, but it's bigger than 5. So anything bigger than 5, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Uh, 11, um, 12, 13, 14. So uh, 14 are bigger than 5. Um, try that again. So it's bigger than 5 just to check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, uh, 11, 12, 13, 14. So I think that's correct. Uh, just note that on probabilities you don't have to cancel fractions down. It's just a an additional complication that can go in there but you should always be aware that if you're given a probability question the the probabilities could have been cancelled down um, so that's the the way I'm leaving them I'm just leaving this 10 over 30 and 14 over 30. Second question was um, listing the outcomes for a game um, so in game one you had three sets of cards you either pulled a sun or a cloud out uh, set two was fish horse or rabbit and set three was lorry boat and I'm going to try to list all the outcomes um, that I could have. Uh, first of all, I could figure out uh, that there's two things can happen here. So two, uh, there's one, two, three things can happen here. And there's one, two things can happen here. And if I just multiply these together, so two times three is six times uh, two is 12. Uh, I should have at the end 12 different outcomes. Okay. So here we go. Um, notice that as well. They're usually different letters. Um, so they're all different letters here. So I don't have to write out the whole thing, I can just write out the uh, first letter of each one. Uh, and I will try to work um, systematically as well. So I'll go with sun to start with, sun, uh, fish, and then lorry is number one. Uh, the next one I'll keep the sun, I'll keep the fish, and I'll keep. I'll get the boat this time. Uh, now I can't have anything of the other, so I've got to change the middle one. So I'm going to go sun, horse, and lorry, and then sun, horse, and um, board. So that's the next one. Uh, the next one is I can't ch change anything else at the bottom again, so I've got to go back to the top. So I've got the sun, uh, this time I've got the rabbit, and then I've got the lorry, and then I'll have the sun, rabbit, and the board. One, two, three, four, five, six, halfway there. 
So I can change uh, the bottom, and I can change the rabbit, so now I've got to change the top one. So I'm going to go with cloud, and if I just do the same thing, so cloud, fish, lorry, cloud, fish, boat, cloud, uh, horse, lorry, cloud, horse, uh, boat, and then last one, cloud, rabbit, lorry, cloud, rabbit, and the boat. Okay, so that's the, all the outcomes, and there's 12. So when I do these probability questions, the probabilities are going to be out of 12. Uh, so the probability of that one is also going to be out of 12. Uh, fractions are the preferred method for probabilities. I don't particularly like decimals, and uh, we could write percentages as well, but that's just nasty. Anyway, so the probability I get a sun and a lorry. So the sun and a lorry. So sun and a lorry, there's one. Uh, and there's two, and there's three, and that's it. So there's 3 out of 12 uh, sons and lorry. And what's the next one? So I can't have a son or I can't have the lorry. So I can't have any of that lot because that lot's all got the sun in it. I can't have this one. That one's okay. Uh, that one, no. That one's okay. That one, no. That one's okay. So it was 1, 2, 3. It was 3 out of 12 again. And that's it for listing outcomes. My maths, 3, 7, 9. Have fun, people.